Yesterday, yeah, we did pick up several inches of snow, at least falling from the sky. It melted very quickly here over the Denver area yesterday. And this morning, we are also picking up some moisture. As you can see, low-lying cloud coverage over Rocky Mountain National Park. Longs Peak saw 20 inches of snow yesterday and still some light lingering snow showers there this morning. Temperatures are in the upper 30s, so it's a chilly morning out there. Overcast skies over downtown and City Park. Winds sustained from the north at 5 miles per hour. We're still dealing with the remnants of yesterday's storm, picking up some rain showers across the northeastern plains, cloudy skies downtown just off to the west near Idaho Springs and Georgetown, light to moderate snow showers, more widespread precipitation, Colorado Springs down into Pueblo. So you'll find some wet roadways heading that direction and also up over the northeastern plains this morning. So still a bit unsettled, but the National Weather Service letting our winter weather advisories and winter storm warnings into the mountains and portions of the Palmer Divide expire as of six o'clock this morning. Our severe storm outlook today is low, so we're not expecting severe weather weather as we get into this afternoon. That risk is mainly out to our east from Kansas down into Texas. Now temperatures out the door. It is a pretty chilly morning. We're below freezing in Leadville at 27 and only in the low 30s near Akron and Sterling. Taking us through the rest of the day today, expect to see some peaks of sunshine over the next several hours. By 11 o'clock, partly cloudy skies, upper 40s. By lunchtime, we'll be in the 50s. It'll feel a little more pleasant there. And as the sun comes in, upper 50s to low 60s by about 2 o'clock this afternoon downtown up through Erie and Boulder. Low 50s in Evergreen, so a milder day into Colorado's high country as well. We're back to the 50s, Steamboat and Eagle. Telluride's still in the up low 40s with high 60s over the southeastern plains. So we do have, as mentioned, the possibility for a few more showers developing off to our west. It'll be a rain-snow mix at lower terrain and mainly snow over our highest mountain peaks near Keystone up over Rocky Mountain National Park. Here's 4.30 this afternoon over northeastern Colorado down into Castle Rock and Parker. Possibility for seeing a few showers roll through, so don't be surprised if you see a little wet weather, but it won't amount to much. So tonight in Denver, temperatures will be in the 50s early on, but gradually fall to the 40s by early tomorrow morning, but a lot of sunshine and a pleasant start to our week. Highs tomorrow will be back in the upper 60s, low 70s, so for the kiddos at the bus stop, t-shirt weather returns in the afternoon. No longer an action day for today, but upper 50s expected, low 70s Monday and Tuesday afternoons, and our next chance for seeing more moisture roll in will be on Thursday.